my beloved brothers and sisters in Yahusha Hamashiach, our Savior and Redeemer and Deliverer. I am Evangelista Perja Ferreira. Brothers and sisters, today I am gonna to talk about the last days in which Daniel the prophet told us that in the latter days the earth will be full or shall be full of knowledge and we are seeing it many truths that were hidden to us are being revealed and we have to give praise to the Most High, our God, the God of Israel. Because these days, many brothers are working zealously for the sake of the good news of the Most High and Yahusha HaMashiach. And they are helping us to know the truth. Because some 10 years ago, not 10 years ago, some 20 years ago, it could be impossible to know that in 2021, the majority of the things that were hidden will be revealed and they are revealed this day. So, at the same time, Yahusha has warned in Matthew 24, verse 4, let no man deceive you, because many false teachers will come in this world, deceiving many. And we are seeing many being misled, deceived, following the false teachers. And we have in this book, because this is our book, all the sources for our faith, because this is the only source we have to live in these last days. This is the only source we have in order for us to live soberly and vigilantly, because our enemy, the devil, walks has a roaring lion seeking who he may devour. It's written in the first Peter chapter 5 verse 80. Brothers and sisters, we have people with many doctrines the doctrines of the demons and the devils. And to confirm this, I will read for you because many of those people, they were once believers in the Lord Yahusha. And today they are denying the Lord Yahusha as their Messiah. So please come with me in First Timothy chapter 4. Verse 1, now 
the Spirit expressly says that in later times some will depart from the faith, giving heed to deceiving spirits and doctrines of demons. It's happening, brothers. And billions of people are following this kind of doctrines. Brothers and sisters, anything that doesn't come from the Holy Spirit comes from the devil. Anything that is being pre preached that is not the gospel of the Ausha HaMashiach and his apostles is from the devil. That's why the Apostle Paul said, if any man preaches to you any other gospel, he shall be a cast, even if it is an angel. He shall be a cast. So, to end with my video, I ask you this. Please live in the faith, because it is written, the just shall live by faith. Rely in the Lord, Yahusha. Rely in God only. Rely only the Most High, your God, the God of Israel. Trust in Him, and He will help you. Oh, I'm sorry. Someone is calling me. I will decline the call. Okay. So, as I was saying, trust in Him, rely in Him, rest in Him. Have a Goshen mentality. While Moshe was in the negotiations with Pharaoh, asking Israel to leave Egypt, the house of Israel, the house of Judah, God's people, they were living in prosperity and abundance. They didn't, they did not lack anything. They had total peace and total security until the day they left Egypt. So we have to live in the same. Don't be anxious of anything. The only thing you have to do is to rely in the Lord, your God, the God of Israel, because Psalm 23 states, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in the green pastures, beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He makes me to walk in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk in the shadow of the valley of death, I, I will fear no evil. You are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup runs over. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Thank you for listening. Thank you for being patient with me.
Shalom.